Turkish Ablaz styled my hair. This is the best sunscreen ever. There's literally no white cast on my face. right now good morning guys i don't know what time it is but it's probably like 11 or 12 if not 12 o'clock today is tuesday i woke up with a stiff neck literally this part of my neck is in pain the nerve in pains but i told myself i'm not going to let that stop me from doing what i wanted to do today so in case my head is a bit stiff <laughs> you guys should just understand that i'm in pains and i'm trying not to move it too much why i'm speaking to you guys now is i wanted to like let you guys know the plans for today and also share a new sunscreen i got so plans for today is i plan to record a video hopefully too but it's what I'm trying to go for a laid back vibe if that makes any sense so it's not too structured that's the plan for the self-development aspect i'm just trying to improve myself guys and just trying to see what works for my channel what you guys like what i like so to the sunscreen i wanted to show you guys one time i was speaking to hawa and Eunice on the phone and we we're talking about sunscreen how sunscreen like leave white cast i think i have like two two different sunscreens i have these two it's this is from Avin and this is from Biodema. Honestly, they leave a cast one way or the other, like they always leave a cast. Or I realized one time whenever I use sunscreen and I do my makeup, it has like this peeling effect, and I hated that, so I just stopped sunscreen as a whole until my friend Hawa told us about this sunscreen. When I tell you, she told me like when the girl put it on her hand, it disappeared. I'm like, well, I'm going to try it. I'm not going to trust it, but I'm going to try it. It's the SVR sunscreen. 50 plus SPF it says it's non greasy and invisible finish so hopefully it works but yeah this is the first time I'm going to try it I have opened it and tried it on my hand and it disappeared if this does not leave a white cast I think this would be the best thing I've recommended to you guys ever let's try it okay let's see here goes something so I'm going to put it on my skin and I'm going to blend it out wait i don't know did you guys see that i did not really blend it for a long time let me put let me show you guys what i mean so this right one okay let me just apply it around my face I literally just hooked you guys up to the best sunscreen ever if you're in turkey i got you from agbati pharmacy you can check pharmacy or you can check trendio but what the hell this is the best sunscreen ever there's literally no white cast on my face as you guys can see you saw how easily it blended into my skin what i've never been a fan of using sunscreen due to the white cast because it just makes me feel very self-conscious because it just looks white and i can notice the white cast but who is this oh my goodness guys i've hooked you up i've hooked you up so you guys should definitely check it out if you're into sunscreen and you love sunscreen that's it it should be around 398 turkish lira it was not more than 400 turkish lira from aquati pharmacy i'm going to go get ready to start recording my videos i'll speak to you guys when i'm done oh my goodness i can't even be cute anyway hi guys so i just finished with my second video i think that's all for today i honestly cannot push myself more than this and i initially planned to record two videos so that's great my neck my neck is aching i'm probably going to continue with my day now maybe i'll find what to eat before i go out because i have a couple of things to do outside i got a couple of things i don't know if i should do a haul i'll probably do it in this vlog so you guys probably see it from the vlog i just got like casual things 
everything so basically i um i have like different style i like like elegance and class outfits like i love looking elegant i love looking classy that's like my vibe even with my natural hair that's my vibe at the same time i like like sneakers and jeans and like laid back vibes i also like like the street style vibe but i'm trying to find a way to mesh street style with elegance and class <laughs> before i wanted to just focus on my elegance and class but i felt i'm not being completely true to myself because i truly enjoy wearing sneakers i truly enjoy wearing like wide leg pants i i enjoy wearing those things my crop tops my dresses and all of that stuff at the same time i truly enjoy wearing like elegant outfits and looking really put together because that's the goal yep putting our lives together i'll show you guys what i got maybe later on let me probably see what i can have for lunch or maybe continue my day I just got back home from the mall it's been a day so basically i got a couple of things from the mall i don't know if you guys saw earlier i showed you guys that i was in a scarf shop i got like two scarves i want to do like a scarf video i got this scarf it's like chocolate brown but not really chocolate brown it's like the size of hijab <laughs> i don't know why i got this length or why i didn't check for the length but let's see Okay, it's not bad it's actually not bad so i got this one and i also got like a brown satin scarf as well so it's just a regular brown satin scarf which is really cool so i i can just use this at home or use it wherever so yep those are the scarves i got i wanted to change an item i got from h&m i got this really nice skirt from h&m for in size small but it was it was my size but it didn't really fit how i wanted it to fit i decided to go back and change it to an extra small right now i'm just tired and I, I need to shower and i want to rest it's been a long day long productive day for me and i'll speak to you guys tomorrow <laughs> things to do today i wrote down my to-do list i like to write down my to-do list these days just so it keeps me organized and i know what i'm doing and i know what i've done and i know what i plan to do i try not to do so much or i try not to write so much on my to-do list so i'm able to achieve everything and if i'm able to do extra things then fine so today i have to I said I was going to work out, I said I was going to make rosemary water for my hair and then I want to ship some things and wash my hair. So I don't know if I should ship before I wash my hair because after I wash my hair I want to do like a African threading video so my hair will be in thread and I wouldn't want to go out with my hair in thread so I'll probably ship before I wash my hair. My neck is still there. <laughs> I can still feel it. <laughs> I can still feel the pain. That's pretty much it. So I'm currently in the middle of recording the rosemary water. I'm waiting for it to cool down before I like um, put it in my spray bottle and stuff. So that's what I'm trying to do. In the meantime, I think I'll just show you guys the things I got, the clothes I got because I'm not necessarily doing anything per se right now. So I'll just do that then I would package the things I'm going to ship and then go ship them and continue my day. Yeah, that's that's the plan. I actually did get a couple of things from Zara and H and M, mostly H and M, because I saw a couple of things, basic things I wanted. I'm going to start with the things I got from H and M. First thing I got was this basic 90s baggy jeans high waist. So it's like a really long baggy jeans and high waist set. I really loved what it looked like on me i think i took some pictures i don't know if i've deleted them it's a bit darker than what it's showing what is showing on the screen right now skinny jeans they never fit my 
legs whenever I get to my ankles they're always like above my ankle and it can be annoying especially when it's cold because my feet can get cold from that so I love wide leg jeans and I've always wanted to own a baggy jean because I just think they're very casual they're very nice the next thing I got was this skirt I don't know if you guys remember this skirt from yesterday this was the skirt I went to change it looks it looks very good on my on me when I tried it on so I went to get the extra small I got some workout clothes like just this short it's a bit darker from what's showing in the camera i got the black ones i got them because they had like pockets honestly and then i also got like a top as well for workout i saw this top right it's like a corset but like it has that corset vibe and it comes down but the back is high i got it in pink as well my skin and blue one of the things I truly appreciate from modeling is I get to see colors that match on my skin and whenever I wear blue it just completes the look <laughs> can you see how it's blending it's, it's just blending I got this blue crop top and then I also got it in a dress a bodycon dress this is my staple summer look I love bodycon dresses I love dresses like in the summer you just see me with my dress my slippers and my bag walking like I don't, I don't want stress. Don't stress me. You see this dress? You see this dress? When I wore this dress, I can't wait for summer. That's it. That's it. It was so beautiful on me. It was so flattering to my body shape, which I really like. So, yeah. And then now I'm going to go to the items I got from Zara. I didn't really get things from Zara, but maybe another day I'll go to Zara. But the things I got from Zara are a basic white shirt. I wanted a basic white shirt I could wear with jeans. I have this. I have this imagination of an outfit so i saw this it's like it's not like the battery on my other camera died i don't know where to look at in this camera anyways the battery died but i will show you guys the white shirt it's like a quality zara shirt if that makes any sense zara has like this basic t-shirt that are like really light I, I hate those i hate i honestly hate those this one this one i really like i got this crop jean top when i saw it it's definitely not what i would go for for a first pick but when i saw it i was just like i may as well just try something new and i think it looks can you see what i told you guys about the blue it just it just makes my skin flow like it just flows with my skin i think i have an idea of how i want to wear it that was why i got it i think it's very laid back simple but not doing too much and the final thing i got was this top this is the only winter friendly thing i got it's just like this basic lined um, knitted top from zara i've always wanted one i don't know why i just think it's something you know when you look at capsule wardrobe they always have one of these shirts and when i tried it on i looked really peaceful yeah that was literally what I got. I looked like I'm at peace with myself and <laughs> I loved that. So I decided to just, you know, get it. So yeah, I think I'm going to get a few more things from Zara. I love Zara because of sometimes the quality, sometimes not all the time. And I also shop from Mango. But I didn't enter Mango. Mango, I usually get like dresses, formal clothes and stuff. But Zara, I get like basic and formal depending on the mood and then h&m is like the basic things that's how i do my shopping and for my jeans i always get them from zara you guys always ask me that i always get my jeans from zara so yeah <coughs> Oh, yeah.
hi guys good evening today is thursday <laughs> i showed you guys earlier that i was just basically editing today so i was able to finish editing i was able to upload the video and now i want to transfer the next video i want to edit part of it last night <laughs> speaking from experience never should you ever 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 try to sleep with a stiff neck and thread on your head okay my neck right now is getting better definitely getting better it's way better than it was last night but guys it was a struggle try to balance my neck to put it in a position where it doesn't ache me and also try to balance the hair if i did not have the neck issue the hair is a lifestyle we grew up with this hair we know how to set our head but with the neck issue it's like the 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 part of the bed that works for the hair does not work for the neck it was a strike i literally woke up with eye bags and i was just pissed off but it's what we do it's what we do but yeah anyways if you don't have neck issues then sleeping with the thread is definitely good to go you're good to go anyways um right now i want to transfer a video from this memory card to my laptop to see if i can edit start editing the next video and I have a shoot tomorrow morning, a wedding shoot. So I have to, they told me to style my hair with the style I did last on my YouTube. Because I created the shots on my Instagram, so they sent it to me. So they told me to style my hair in that manner. I think I'll do it tomorrow morning. I'll probably wake up earlier. I should probably sleep early. I'll wake up earlier to do that. But I would definitely pack my bag or pack my makeup and stuff this night i have to do that i hate not packing and then dreaming of packing does that make sense i'm someone if i know i have to do something i would rather do it before i sleep than sleep and in order to wake up and do it because i wouldn't sleep properly because i'll keep thinking oh shoot i have to do this So don't let me down I chase away your shadows Away from the crowd I give you my tomorrow Forever now Spotlight from my cell phone Sounds like it's your ringtone I get chills when you call Wanna give Appalachian sunrise meets my skin Even with my eyes still closed, I can feel it coming in Golden, golden. I'll follow only golden, golden Golden, golden, golden. 
golden things Mount Laurel high fives For miles in spring Rainbow trout and hummingbird wings. Golden I'll follow really good on me anyways hi guys hello so i just got back home from work can you see how set my makeup is like it's literally still set yes my face is shiny but like the makeup is not shifting i had a, a wedding photo shoot today they were so lovely the dress was so lovely there was one i really loved and it was so nice like all of them were great but there was one specific one that i loved i didn't really vlog while i was working because usually i don't have time and i didn't really know how the, the job today was going to be i would say i actually did have a good time i did my makeup myself of course i'm obviously in a good mood i did my hair but after i did my hair <laughs> guys god works in mysterious ways so i was trying to go for my last hairstyle video on my channel but i don't know this morning i don't know if i'm going to put the video here or i'm going to do a separate video but i recorded it this morning when i was doing the hairstyle my mind just said just slick this instead of doing the twist the flat twist and i did it and it came out so beautifully but like the ladies the ablas i don't know what they called ablas they changed the style for like the third dress i believe or the second dress because i had hair accessories and it was just like full so they changed it let me show you what turkish how turkish women styled my hair turkish ablas styled my hair but you guys should rate turkish ablas hair hair skills like i think it looks really put together i feel like i want to record this style for you guys <laughs> you get like some chablas that gave me idea i was just like what who is this like i have my two clip clipping at the back of my hair because it gives that full vibe i love the full vibe if my hair was longer i wouldn't add clippings but i really love like full vibe now it's very casual very calm very not doing too much today was great today was nice i'm actually happy like i got to experience this and yeah so right now i'm going to take out my contacts and i'm going to i'm going to take out my contacts and i'm going to take a shower and i'm going to probably continue my day i'll probably edit a video because i was supposed to upload a video today but i had a job so i'm probably going to do that now hello guys good morning today is sunday i'm currently getting ready to go to church i know i haven't done a church vlog in a long time but i found this church in levent i've gone there like three sundays and it, ha it has been great i really like the church it's very chilled very calm they're not doing too much they're not in your business they're just preaching and leave that's it i genuinely i know church is more like a fellowship and all of that but like sometimes when i go to certain churches and there's just this energy where they're doing too much I, I don't enjoy going to that church but like when i found this church i'm like okay this is cool this is nice i think i found it from someone on instagram posted it and then i asked him like oh where's this church and then he gave me the address like last year but i kept procrastinating and then three sundays ago i decided to just go and it was great and i went last week and this week so i'm back to my church routine 
back in the day when I was in Cyprus, even in Turkey as well, I used to enjoy going to church. I just like the fellowship, okay? I just like being where people are. As long as you're not in my business and you're not disturbing me, I would go to church definitely. Anyways, I'm about to, I've done my hair. It's currently sitting, like I always put it to sit. I'm about to put on my earrings. I'm deciding to wear these earrings from Swarovski. I really love them. I'm a huge fan of Swarovski, like <laughs> definitely a huge fan. Hopefully it goes. <laughs> when I was getting these, I saw, hey, imagine if it falls down the drain, I would cry. <laughs> I saw like the studs, but I just wanted something that would, you know, hang down, not just something simple because I got like the necklace as well. So this is nice. I want to see if it goes with my hair and my dress. Because I'm wearing a black dress. Oh, it goes. Mm -mm. I finished work, don't worry. <laughs> okay, it goes. It definitely goes. It's a beaut. It's a beaut. Okay, so I'll tie my hair back. So I am currently ready to leave home. I just wanted to come in and show you guys like the outfit. So it's this dress I got. I got it from a Turkish website. <laughs> I cannot really remember the website I got it from, but I got it from a Turkish website. I'm bending right now, but I got it from a Turkish website. I've had it for about two years from my previous apartment. I haven't really worn it out. I've worn it to take pictures, but I haven't worn it out. Anyways, this is what it looks like. It's really nice on my body. And the length, I will take this down so I can show you guys the length. But it's like mid between my knee and my ankle. A bit lower closer to my ankle rather but then there's a slit here that just makes it you know more flattering and more elegant and here there's like this elastic that like clips it together my hair is in sort of like a low bun ish vibe it's similar to what I had for the wedding shoot but not exactly the ones that Turkish Ablas did for me let me show you guys I don't know what it looks like I've not seen it honestly I'm freestyling it at this point and the bag I'm going to be carrying is this bag I got from I think mango so basically the concept of this outfit or how I plan to go is like this and I'm ready to go I'm just wearing like normal sandal here that's pretty much my outfit and I'm going to be on my way out now I'll see you guys when I see you guys maybe I'm closing the vlog here it was really nice this vlog is probably one of my longest vlogs ever I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you watched to this end please let me know in the comment section below tell me you loved it or tell, tell me your thoughts did you enjoy the long vlogs or should I do shorter vlogs thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye